Hey, good morning, everyone. Rob here for glorious morning here in North Naples at blue sky. Oh, the about seventy two degrees. It hit one in parts of southwest Florida. Definitely warming up. Breezy out there on the beach this morning. Looks like the surf has calmed down a little bit since yesterday. Good morning, Nancy. Rose, good morning. I am trying out a new microphone here. Hopefully it's working. Hopefully you can hear me. Hey, Lisa, Deb, good morning. Donald, good morning. Sandy, good morning. Good morning. Paul, everybody coming on here. Hetty, good morning. Oh, two ladies heading out for a swim. A swim, an early morning swim. That water temperature is warming up. 78 degrees is the water temperature. like we are surrounded once again with beautiful blue skies. Just a couple thin little wispy white clouds. Might get a little cloudy later on this morning. We'll take a little stroll down the beach then turn around and head north up to Wiggins Pass. Paradise, absolute paradise this morning. Yeah, there's Dexter. I see Dexter heading down the beach here behind me. See what that water looks like now. There is some red tide about. Unfortunately, the red tide is rearing its ugly head again. I'm not smelling anything here. The wind's coming from the east, so it's blowing the stink out into the gulf. <laughs> Gary, our friend Gary was out here yesterday and he messaged me and said he could smell the red tide sitting up in the skybox. He said it wasn't really bad. We're at low tide right now. It's not a very low, low tide. Actually, it's a pretty high low tide. Good morning.
we've got that super moon, the pink moon. It was pretty, pretty neat this morning. It set at about 7.15. It sank into the gulf. And there he is, our Southwest Florida television beach patrol and food critic, all wrapped into one. Exactly. Yeah. Good morning, Rob. Good morning. So? No dolphins today. No dolphins. I could walk through up to Area 5 today, though. You did get up there. Yeah. The tide was low enough? The tide was low enough. Boy, it's really washed out up there. Isn't it? It's changed drastically up yeah, there. Absolutely. Man. But, uh, no turtle nest. I saw the turtle guy again. No, no nest no yet. Nest yet so. None here at Wiggins. Nope. So. What are they waiting for? I don't know. Come no on. Dolphins either. No dolphins. Yeah, I haven't seen any dolphins for two days. Yeah, me either. So. Oh, wow. oh well. But. You know they'll be back. Yes, they will. We went down to the pier, Roy and I, Sunday. We I saw a dolphin. Oh, did you? At least saw one dolphin down there. Wow. Well, that was about it. I'm surprised that no birds though. Notice that? Yeah, I don't know what happened to all our birds. They just kind of disappeared. I know. Uh, I know there's a little bit of red tide, but I don't think that should. It's not bad here. No, the the couple that just walked past there, they were asking where the where are the birds. I'm like, I don't know. <laughs> they didn't tell me. I know. I know. They didn't check in. They just left without leaving a note. <laughs> I know. But otherwise, it's a gorgeous day. It is beautiful. Yeah. Might get a little cloudy later on, but that's all right. Yeah. Breaks things up. Makes exactly. for, I like the clouds. It makes for more interesting pictures. It does. You know? Yeah, I, I, agree. I like the blue sky, but I like it all. I like it all. I like it all. <laughs> exactly. All right. Well, enjoy Thank your you morning. Thank you. You too. All right, Dexter. It is a glorious morning. No doubt about that. We'll just go down here a little ways before turning around. Good morning, by the way. Thanks for tuning in. Hit that share button, invite your friends to tag along with us. Well, I'm assuming you guys can hear me. Or else you just think it's a silent movie. I don't know, one or the other. I've got a new microphone system here. It should help with knocking out a little bit of the wind noise. Not all of it, but some of it. Better than before. I'm going to try a couple other little gadgets when there's money. Awesome, Connie. Thank you for the confirmation there. Much calmer out here than yesterday. Thank you, Rose. Doohickeys. Yep, some doohickeys. Get some more doohickeys.
This is actually a wireless microphone system that I'm using. I've got a little transmitter in my pocket and a little microphone clipped onto my shirt. And then there's a really cool receiver that clips onto the camera. It's called the Movo, M-O-V-O. It had some really great reviews. I tested it out yesterday. It seemed to work fine at the house. So this is the real test, the beach. The only thing I can't do now is run out into the water and chase dolphins. That's the only downside. But it works with the gimbal. It took forever to find something that would work in conjunction with the gimbal. I love this view of the beach here. One of my favorite little morning views. Get down low. The grass and the pines. I just love that view in the morning. Just looks so natural. So our friend Vincent from Vinny's Texas Roadhouse Cookies sent me a message the other day. Want me to make a little promo for him. That's kind of cool. Got to check out those cookies. They're really good. Those were the cookies that Gary and I were eating. What was that, Saturday morning when I was out here? Friday, Friday morning, I think it was. Check that video out. Really good cookies. You can order them online. I think it's called Vinny's Scrumptious Pies and Cakes. You'll find them on Facebook. But the cookies were awesome. Good size, too. We're going to turn around here and start walking up to the north towards Wiggins Pass. Hopefully I'll see Roy sitting out in his chair. Roy's really slowing down. I think his walking days are over, unfortunately. As I said earlier, this water is really starting to warm up. 78 degrees. Looks like out in the background there in the distance, some kind of law enforcement boat heading up the beach. It's that battleship gray color. All kinds of gadgets on it, radar and things. Or else it's a, maybe it's a stealth fishing boat. <laughs> Got some amazing boats down here. Amazing. Good morning, how are you doing today? Good. So I really don't understand how the moon 
works with the tides. I mean, a normal moon, I understand, but the super moons, we had a super moon last night, the pink moon, it just set about an hour ago. But sometimes when we have a super moon, the tides are really, really low. And sometimes when we have it, the tides are really, really high. So I don't know how that works. I don't know what causes that. If it's a cycle, if it's every other one or whatever. Morning. But this morning it's low tide right now. And it's not a really low tide, a super low tide. It's higher than a normal low tide, actually. So we're in that cycle, I guess. I don't know how it works. I know there's some genius out there that knows the answer watching. Good morning. Good morning. Look at that beautiful sky. I don't know how long it's going to last. You can see some clouds over there to the east. Taco Tuesday. Happy Taco Tuesday, everyone. Uh-oh. <coughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> I had to sneeze. I'm not allergic to tacos. I don't know what happened there. <laughs> the hazards of being live. You get it all. You get my sneezes, my burps, my hiccups. <laughs> you get it all. My under the breath comments sometimes. <laughs> margaritas and tacos. Who's having tacos and margaritas today? It's funny how that is just caught on everywhere. We usually just have our tacos at home. You like hard shell or soft shell tacos? I like soft shell. That's my favorite. It's going to be a party when you get here, Donnie and Jackie. I want the two of you here together. And Jan, huh? Oh, love to get Jan down here. She sent me a nice little note yesterday. She sends her love to everybody. She says, thank you for keeping her in your prayers. She's still going through this oral surgery routine. She misses everybody. She wishes she could be on. She's got some problems with her phone. She needs to get a new phone. It won't keep a charge anymore, or at least get new batteries. So she's been missing us. I don't know if she's on with us this morning. She said she was going to try to get on this morning. Right now I can't see the comments with the sun hitting the screen. But Jan sends her love and says thank you for keeping her in your thoughts and prayers. Which brings me to anybody. Anybody out there needing prayers, feel free to add your request in the comments here. We are here to support each other. We got a wonderful group of people. There's no religious persecution here. <laughs> God bless all of you. No matter what religion. And we don't talk about politics here. If you're new to the, the family here, we stay away from politics. Plenty of other places to rant and rave about that BS. It's not even worth talking about. Just gets most people's blood boiling. So just 
We stay away from it here. Other than that, you can talk about anything you want. Hobbies, favorite beaches, sports, food. Food's a common topic. The weather. What's the weather like where you're at? It's so different in different parts of the country. It's unbelievably warm here now. Warm and beautiful. Where, oh, where is Roy? Where is Roy now? He's up sitting on the picnic tables, I'm guessing. Or is he in his chair? I don't know. He's got to take a break when he's walking out to the beach. He can't walk out in one shot anymore. I hope he doesn't try to walk up to the stump. Beautiful here. This is absolute paradise here. Squirrels, a couple squirrels jumping around in the trees here. They were over in here jumping around. This is where Audrey's bench is over here. Under the big pine tree. bench that Roy had placed in memory of his late wife, Audrey, with the beautiful poem that he wrote for her. He had this poem written and he wrote it and recited it on their wedding day, a time of love, a time of prayer, a time to tell we really care, a time to dance, a time to sing. A time to hear the heavens ring. A time to leave the outworn way. A blessed time, a newborn day. A time for comradeship and friends. A time, a time that never ends. 
Amen, huh? Dearest Audrey, you will always be with us. We'll always be loved. She's here right now at the beach with us. I know it. I can feel her presence. Watching over Roy. Keeping an eye on him. We got construction going on here. So it's an obstacle course to get to the beach. They've got it closed, which is a real pain in the butt. A real pain in the butt for us. Got to walk all the way around this. Come all around. Not good. Not good for Roy. One of these days they'll pour that concrete. It's been dug up now for quite a few weeks. really nice back in here with the picnic tables. There's several picnic tables, barbecue grills. They don't have as many as they used to. They've got them all in storage right now just because of the COVID. Just trying to spread people out. But there's still quite a few picnic benches and tables and grills throughout the park. I always try to encourage people to take a walk back here. Walk the trail. There's more to the park here than the beach. See, there's another table and grill. This trail starts up in oh, area four, goes up to area five. Of course, the beach is our favorite place here, our favorite attraction at the park. That's what this park is noted for. It's a mile long stretch of beach, give or take a hundred yards or so, depending on the tide and Mother Nature, if she washed them away. <laughs> so Roy, I think, is still sitting in the car. Sitting in the car. Can't get up enough steam. We'll see. Good morning. Hey, thank you for those stars. That is sweet. If you're liking what you're seeing, I do rely on your financial generosity. If you'd like to send a tip, you can find a link to my PayPal account in the description of this post, and I do appreciate it. Every dollar helps, believe me. Awesome, isn't it? Hello. No sea turtles yet. Don't know where those ladies are. 
No sea turtles. Plenty of gopher tortoises. Those are land turtles. Won't get them mixed up. The gopher tortoises can't swim. What a drastic difference up at Wiggins Pass on the beach. My gosh. Just in a couple of days, it changed so dramatically. Unbelievable. We'll get up there. We'll be up there shortly. That'll probably be part two of my morning beach walk here, my Tuesday morning beach walk. I am going to see if one of our little gopher tortoises is up here. He was out yesterday. We saw him at the end of part two of yesterday morning's beach walk. Out getting some Fresh air and sunshine. There's quite a few of these tortoises in the park. Remember, keep your hands off them. Not any sunshine here yet. Probably a little dark for them to be out. Yep, still a little on the dark side. That's their burrow right down there. But this, remember we looked up the tree. Looking at a little while ago from down in area four. This is looking back the other way. So many little hidden surprises here at the park. Don't hear any birds. A lot of times we'll be back here and the birds are just singing away. And if I just take this trail a little further up the beach, it's gonna bring me out at the south end of Area 5. One of our back is here. There's six of these. I never keep track. Five or six of these bathhouses. Restrooms changing. And then there's outdoor showers. They keep them really clean. Renovating all of them. The showers are over here. You can see them over there. Sticking up. All handicap accessible. They all have ramps leading up to them. Nice little boardwalk here to take you up the beach. Here's the beach out here. You're never far from the beach when you're on the trail. You should recognize where I'm at. If you're a regular follower,
Another one of our little gopher tortoise burrows is over here. I haven't seen any tortoises over here though lately. It's getting kind of overgrown and hard to see. It's right down in there. You can really, it's getting really hard to see in there. And I don't see any little heads sticking out. Boy, it is warming up here, that's for sure. Lots of little shells along the shoreline. Nothing catching my eye yet. Nothing saying, pick me up, pick me up. Good morning, Robert. Robert, I shared your review this morning, well, your, your post for Industry Pizza. Looks like an interesting pizza in Naples, Industry Pizza. Might have to go check that out the next time you come down here. Go over to Grandpa's, check Grandpa's out, and then go check Industry. I love pizza. Good morning. How you doing? Good, how are you? How, how else could you be? <laughs> That's kind of a rhetorical question. It answers itself. It's beautiful. It is. And it's getting a little quieter. Yeah. We're late this year. Oh, yeah? Yeah, March to April. So now April to May. Oh, you're going to like that even more. The water's great. Yep. You too. Rich out here looking for glass. How you doing, Rich? Good, good man. Good. Find anything anything good this morning? Glass. Oh, those are little ones too. I don't know how you see them. I don't know how you tell the difference between broken shells and pieces of glass and shark's teeth. Yeah. Oh my gosh, did you know Shara the ranger? Yeah. She found a shark's tooth about that big here last week. Just, she said that much of it was sticking up out of the sand. Really? Yep. I wish. She, <laughs> yeah, I, I wish too. <laughs> One of these days, yeah. it's going to happen. <laughs> yep. You too. Our prayer tree, our famous prayer tree. The shells are getting kind of sparse on it. 
the waves have been battering this tree and the shells have been getting knocked off, falling into the water. Good morning. It's gonna need to get repopulated. With all those waves, it's knocked all the shells off the yeah. tree. <laughs> oh yeah, this is becoming a famous tree. It'll be interesting to see what it looks like up at the pass this morning. I was quite surprised when I got up there yesterday. See, low tide and it's pretty difficult to get around here. I'm going to take the high road. Take the high road. Too many branches sticking out there. Good morning. How are you doing? What you seeing? Did, oh, the pelicans, yeah. There's been a lot of them lately. Have a good Hey, if you're just joining us, good morning. Happy Tuesday. Happy Taco Tuesday. We're up in North Naples, Florida at Del Norwegian's Pass State Park. Enjoying the beach, enjoying the sights and the sounds. Hoping to see a dolphin or two, but so far, no luck. We're at the north end of the park, coming up to Wiggins Pass. Such a nice, an unspoiled beach, no homes, condos. They just let Mother Nature run her course here. They don't do anything to really clean the beach up other than pick up trash and remove any safety hazards. But as far as the dead trees go, they just let Mother Nature deal with them. Those dead trees do serve a purpose. They still line. They also for our local birds. Also great photo ops. Photos, wedding photos, anniversary photos. These trees. Well, here we are, Wiggins Pass, in what's left of our 
boardwalk. Our boardwalk, our collapsing boardwalk, and the boat across the pass, still there, unfortunately. The sinking sailboat is still there. We're on bare, just off of Barefoot Beach. Sad, sad sight. Awesome, Tina. Hopefully you get to meet you when you're here. Good view up the coast this morning. All the way up, that's Lely Barefoot Beach, then Bonita Beach up here, Estero. Then Fort Myers Beach behind the Pelican there. Uh, might be a bad... Oh, you're losing the video too, Jackie. Huh. If it was the sound, it might be the new mic, but if it's the video, that's the connection issue. So did we did lose our connection here one time already this morning? For some reason, there's I have up here at the north end of the park sometimes. And what's weird is it's a beautiful morning. You'd think if it was a lousy morning, it would affect the con Now what happens up here? Something. I'm going to start a new live feed anyway here shortly. Oh, here's Kevin. Today he's Ranger Kevin. On a mission. On a mission from God. Yeah, I got sent by the boss to check a few things out over here. So uh, that's what I'm doing. How's it look this morning? Good. Don't know what's going on up here. Don't know what is causing that. Anyway, like I said, I was saying earlier, I'm going to start a new live feed here. So thanks for watching. Thanks for being a friend. Thanks for your financial support. If you like what you see, I appreciate tips. Account in the description of this post. Send a little thank you. End of the month is near. Due, and I do rely on that money to make ends meet every month. Be sure to tell your friends about Southwest Florida Television. Spread the word, share the love. Bringing wonderful people together one beach walk at a time. That's what it's all about. Good morning. How you doing? Where's that? Michigan. Michigan. All right. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> One of our friends from Michigan. So you can do some ice fishing up there. Anyway, if I don't see you later, have a wonderful, wonderful Tuesday. 
Stay safe, stay healthy. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.